This video is all about the hub receiver from the guys over at Wolf International. It's got so many features and functions. I'm not gonna be able to cover them all in this video, but what I'm gonna do is pick out some key points um, that really make this suitable for my fishing and hopefully yours as well. So let's get into it. First up, let's talk about the build quality. Now obviously build quality is an extremely important thing. The last thing you want is for a bit of kit to let you down when you're out on the bank. These are designed, manufactured and tested before they go out in the UK. That means if you have any problems whatsoever, you've got someone right here on home ground that you can talk to about your issue and then get it resolved as soon as possible. That being said, I can't imagine you're gonna have any problems with one of these. They offer a three year warranty and anyone that's willing to do that on an electrical piece of equipment that you leave outdoors on a fairly regular basis, well, they certainly have faith in their product. Obviously, it's fully weatherproofed. It's made out of a hard, durable plastic. The buttons are rubberized. It's got a nice, sort of nice weighty feel to it. It's not so heavy that you're gonna sort of begrudge carrying it around. That being said, it also doesn't feel lightweight and plasticky, which, you know, when it comes to something that is a premium product, you definitely don't want it to feel cheap or look cheap. And uh, well, this certainly doesn't. Next up, let's talk about functionality. Now, 99% of the receivers on the market kind of all do the same thing. You get an indication on your alarm, you then get an indication on your receiver so that you kind of know what's going on. The hub receiver from the guys over at Wolf is a little bit different. This is more like a command center for, for all of your Wolf connected equipment. Whether that be a set of alarms, an anti-theft device, or even a bivy light, you can change all of the settings from this receiver. Whether that be tone, sensitivity, volume adjustment, or LED colors or brightness, you can get it all straight from the hub. A couple of other nice functions that you may be interested in, there's a bivy light built into this, so you literally push and hold the side button and all the LEDs across the top there will illuminate. Don't get me wrong, it's not enough to guide yourself around a 60 acre lake in the middle of the night, but if you're rummaging through your kit bag, this could be the way forward. One of my favorite functions of this receiver is the global mute. Literally a single button push, it'll mute all your alarm heads so you can set your bobbins, recast rods, set clutches, do whatever you need to do, get back to your receiver and double push that global mute button and it'll reset it all back to standard. Nobody wants to be that person that's upsetting their neighbors while out on the bank. We've all heard it. We've all been the person on the other end. Nobody enjoys it. So Wolf have incorporated that to try and keep those annoying alarm sounds to an absolute minimum. Next up, let's talk a little bit about connectivity. So this hub receiver can actually connect to 24 different devices all at the same time. That means you can get indication from a couple of different sets of alarms, plus a bivy light, plus your anti-theft device, all into this one receiver that you have in your pocket. Never as carp anglers have we ever been more connected to exactly what's going on around us. And that is due to items of tackle, like this hub receiver, like the anti-theft devices, and like the QI alarms, the Q alarms, and the Q2 alarms. They all go an extremely long way to keeping you informed about what's going on in your swim. Now, any section about connectivity wouldn't be complete unless we spoke about the range two kilometers, which is obviously an extremely long way. Now, most of us will only ever be 10 yards off of your rods, but what that two kilometer range actually enables is you to have an extremely strong signal from the receiver to your alarms to make sure you're definitely not gonna miss anything that's going on in your swim. There's also a range check feature built into this receiver. That way you can just guarantee 100% that you've got the strongest signal possible. talk about indication. So for this receiver to indicate to you that something's going on in your swim, you've got a row of LEDs at the top and you've also got the extremely bright LCD screen. The LEDs flash in two different ways. If it's a forward take, you get a constant LED light. If you get a drop back, you end up with a flashing LED. That way you already know without even looking at the alarm head exactly what's going on in the swim. The LEDs change color. There's seven different colors in there. Obviously when you change the color on the alarm head, that's instantly replicated onto the receiver so you know exactly which alarm is relevant to which LED. The LCD screen which is used to navigate through the menus and obviously so you can see what settings you're changing is extremely bright and extremely contrasty. It's really easy to read even in bright sunshine and when you come to the evening that's when the backlight comes into play. It's colour changeable so you can customise that to match your alarms or obviously just pick any colour that you like. It's also brightness adjustable. In the daytime you're going to want that brightness to turned up so you can see the screen nice and easily, but at night time, you're gonna want it nice and dim. The last thing you want is to look at that 
flight receiver and then it to dazzle you when you're trying to rummage around in your bivvy or maybe you're trying to run out to get a rod. There's also a time and date function on the receiver. Basically, it creates a log of any indications that you've had. If you're the type of person that likes to record all that information, sort of when you got to take, where you got to take, the time and date and the moon phase, that sort of info, then this will certainly help you do that. We're not all that good at instantly writing that kind of info down. So being able to go back and check it a couple of days later is certainly a handy feature. When it comes to battery life, you'll be extremely pleased to hear that this has got a 500 hour standby time, which is absolutely ages. You're certainly not gonna to have to be replacing batteries on a regular basis with this receiver. That being said, when you do, you're gonna be extremely pleased to find out that all you need is some AA batteries. These are available at any supermarket, any small shop, and you definitely are not gonna to have to hunt around for those odd rare size batteries. While we're on the subject of battery, there's also a indicator on the LCD display, gives you it in a percentage, so you're gonna know well ahead of time before you actually need to replace the batteries. And last but not least, let's talk about the price. When it comes to purchasing a set of QI alarms, and then you have to pick whether you want the QR or the hub receiver, there's a 30 pound difference. So the QR is the cheaper one. I think Luke has previously done a video on that, so pop onto the channel and take a little look at that one. But like I say, the hub one is the more premium product. It's got a lot more features, and this is definitely the one that I would pick every single time. For any more information on these products, do pop onto the Wolf International website. Please like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and make sure you hit that bell notification icon. Now there should be a couple of boxes either side of me. I never know where they're gonna be. Um, they'll take you to other videos on our channel that may be of interest. Have a little watch of those. On this one, pop down into the comments. Let me know one item of tackle that you could not leave home without. This is certainly on my list. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much.